We are wrapping up today's Most Buffalo at the Birchfield Penny Art Center, exploring two exhibits, The Language Within Us and Interfield. We're going to start with The Language Within Us and one of the artists behind it, Michael Mandolfo, and I got a wonderful tour, um, thanks to you, of this exhibit. It's so beautiful. It's a combination of painting and photography. You are the photography side of that. Tell me a little bit about how this came together. Um, Mohamed Saman, the painter in this exhibit, uh, and I were introduced a few years ago. And uh, we uh, kind of aligned in our message of positive artwork um, with positive messages. Mohamed paints language as, as fragments and uh, he uses three languages and they're purposely, uh, his paintings are purposely abstract. And we used that abstraction and carried it over into photography. So the language became physical, an environment, part of the person, maybe emanating from a person. And that was a, that was a lot of fun developing that. And the interesting thing too is that there's, it's all around you here as well and then you invite people who visit to also contribute to this as well with their own voice. We do, we do. We encourage people to call in as an audio portion to this exhibit and call in and, and tell us their thoughts about language. Maybe um, they grew up hearing Polish in the house or Italian or German. Uh, how does that affect them? How does somebody whose English is a second language uh, deal with that duality? And now we're over here at Interfield, a place that used to be a couple of boring classrooms, Dennis Marr, but now it's anything but. Tell me about what we're looking at in this room. We are looking at an immersive artwork that provides functional spaces for the art education classes here at the Birchfield Penny Art Center. It's a project that was built by Assembly House 150 and our team of, of tradespeople, artisans, artists and students uh, working to teach skills in the construction arts while we transform spaces into inspiring and immersive environments for people to make discoveries and to, to learn new things while they're working in a hands-on way. And it's such a beautiful place to just look around, but the other thing that's sort of unique about this is that you're encouraged to interact with it as well. I think that's super important. I think that, you know, the idea of interfield, it's an interactive field of things, of, of objects to be discovered and explored. And so we wanted to create an environment that would encourage people to, to uh, study things, to interpret things, to touch things, to look very closely at things, and then to make art as a response to things. And today, uh, we need spaces that inspire tactility, saturate the senses, wake people up to the, be the beauty and the plenty of stuff. So you can come check out Interfield anytime. It's going to be here indefinitely. The language within us will be here until September. And you can always learn more by going to birchfieldpenny.org. That is Most Buffalo for today. Thanks so much for being here. I'm Kate Wellschofer. Be well, stay well. We'll see you next time.